Hello YouTube. It has been a week since we dropped the bikes off and I just got a text this morning from, from Chris saying that uh, they're all ready to go. So uh, ahead of schedule, which is, is so exciting. So I'm going to go down and, and pick the bikes up, get excited about all of the new changes. Libby's not with us today. She's down at the Great Ocean Road soaking up some sunshine. So plan of attack is I'm going to go pick the bikes up today and then meet her down at the Great Ocean Road. From there, we can pick apart the bikes and go over all of the new changes and then take them out for a spin. We've actually decided that we're going to commit to a clockwise loop of Australia. So it's actually quite fitting that we're going to be down on the Great Ocean Road because that's the first area that we'll be riding through on our big trip. So perfect area to test out the bikes and froth over all new features. I haven't been this excited in a long time. I can't wait to get down to the shop and just geek out over the bikes with Chris. So let's get it. Blah. 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 Oh boy. <sighs> I am almost speechless. I don't really know what to say. They did such a good job. Big shout out to Chris and the crew at Pedal Cyclery. They did everything we asked and more and in such a short time frame as well. Unbelievable. These bikes mean mean everything to us. It's such such a huge thing to be able to be riding comfortably, be riding on smooth bikes, efficient, something that can charge all of our electronic devices as we go. Without these bikes, we have no trip and we can't see Australia. So I'm absolutely over the moon. I've been expressly told by Libby that I'm not allowed to ride the bikes until I take them out and show them to her. So we're gonna lock them away. Not looking at them. Have a little look at them. Oh, cheeky. So tomorrow we'll head out to the Great Ocean Road, give the big unveil to Libby and take them for a spin on some, some beautiful coastal roads out there. I can't wait to jump on. I can't, I can't ride it now. I'm not allowed. That's breaking all the rules. So uh, yeah, let's pack up the bikes tomorrow, jump on the road and, uh, and test them out. Okay, we've made it to Apollo Bay. So I'm gonna bring the bikes through the lip um, and show her what we've got to work with. Hello. Here you go. Here it is. Oh my goodness. That's so cool. You got your new wheels? Check out the wheels. So sick. All right, shall we run through the parts? Yeah. I'll take you through it. All right, so starting from the front of mine, I've got some new Tektro Aero brake levers, which I had a little bit of a squeeze. I didn't ride the bike. Ah. I didn't ride the bike, Lucky. but I had a bit of a squeeze <laughs> and they're gripping the rim so tight, it's brilliant. We've run some new cabling throughout the whole bike, so my gearing system and my braking system. And that's now sitting underneath some new black cork uh, grip tape. It looks so beautiful. It's flush, it's swish. I don't have cables running over my hands anymore. I'm loving that. Mm -hmm. The headset's been altered, so we've put some new spaces in and now I've got a pro stem, which is slightly elevated. So that's lifting me right up and looks like it's going to be a lot more comfortable to ride. All the big news is happening at the front here. We've had some hand built ACE 19 Alex rims with the dynamo hub put in and some stainless steel spokes. So the dynamo hub is now fully hooked up and running. We're connected to a, uh, a wide beam flashlight at the front but also connected to a USB so we can charge all of our devices. As we move further to the back, the back wheel's also been replaced, another hand-built wheel at the back. New cassette, still a seven speed, which suits me very well with my range, and a brand new chain, which is beautiful. New brake pads put on, it's, uh, it's looking really nice. All right, same as James, we've got, was it Ace-19? Ace-19. Yep, yep. Ace-19 rims. The double wall, so they're a lot thicker and sturdier and stronger. 
Uh, the dynamo hub's hooked up, so as it turns, it's generating energy and it stores it in the battery compartment. So that's also got a cable, so we can charge all of our, you know, our camera, our phones, whatever else it is that we've got on a USB. That can now get charged whilst we're riding or when we've stopped if we want to use the battery pack. I've also got a new gear shifter here, uh, and a Shimano brake as well. The gear shifter they found second hand, so it's a really top quality one, but they managed to get it at a cheaper price. Uh, so they also found an 8 speed Shimano cassette, which is amazing, it's so shiny and brand new. Uh, new chain, second hand derailleur, which looks in perfect condition. I am just so excited to get on the bike and see how it goes. Yeah, now we're doing a test them. So we're in Apollo Bay, beautiful, beautiful sky, not a cloud to be seen. So let's go out and have a bit of fun. <laughs> So we just went out on the Great Ocean Road and the ride was amazing. Great Ocean Road is probably my favourite place to ride. It's just so flowy and smooth and the bikes would just stand out. Everything is working perfectly, it's smooth. The bikes are actually silent, which is unusual for me. This was just like floating on a cloud, it was great. So Chris said that the Dynamo hubs might cause some drag on the wheels and kind of feel like they're slowing you down a little bit, but we didn't feel any of that. Maybe when we're like pushing up a big hill we might notice it, but didn't see anything today. So absolute success on the road. That was so much fun to get out there again. They're riding the part now. We've just got to make them look the part. So next episode, we're going to be sanding them back and then spraying them. We've got the colors all sorted. The spray paint's in now in our garage. So we're going to spray them some, uh, some pretty nice colors and get them steed on these blacks. So if you're liking the videos, and want to follow the journey for the next six months, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Next video is dropping in a week. We'll show you all the new changes that we've made.